What's going on guys, welcome back to Nolan TCG and we're here today with the winner of our second winner mat tourney. He uh, took home the nice red eyes map. It is Loza. I do be playing the red eyes cards. He is playing monkey unga boonga make red eyes deck. I sure do. It's, it's gonna work really well. We'll oh, slide no. this mat to the side to show off the beautiful mat follow it. And take us through your deck profile Loza. Alright, let's do it. Let's start with the uh, bread and butter of the deck. Uh, you pray your opponent doesn't have ash. That's all I can say but you play card. three, so you can just resolve another. Well, not under Ash, but if they hard <laughs> negate with Herald or anything else like Solemns, you're like, cool, next one? Speaking of next one, this card does like the same thing. It searches Fusion, it dumps Wyvern, um, but also if they Ash it, like they're just brain dead. Um, if you open this in Fusion and they Ash this, you're like, cool, free Fusion. Um, but anyway, it's, it's kind of a weird card, but we have to play another Brick for it as well. But it's kind of too good to be able to have six copies of Fusion. Um, anyway, let's move on to more bricks. So here we are. <laughs> Three bricks in already. There's a couple more. Clearly this deck didn't brick. Yeah. Well, see, we have 18 starters. I'll get to that later. <laughs> yeah. Uh, speaking of them starters, Meltdown is one of them. It do be searching uh, your boy Alistar. Um, good card. Gives you a mecha bar and also comes back to your hand. Uh, we play one invo, which a lot of people are like, why one? And it's just because we play so many bricks. Okay. S straight up. It's a brick we can kind of cut, and if they negate it, well, oh well. <laughs> but what if you use Rely it to fusion with the two bricks that you drew that were vanilla colored? That has Dragoon come up him? once, <laughs> where I actually invoed out Dragoon. Um, probably should never happen though, it's really bad. Yeah. <laughs> uh, now we get into the engine that wins me every game. Um, Numerons. So Wall, not only does it win through just activating Network, being a battle fader, Everyone kind of forgets that effect and goes to swing with access code after they pop your whole board. And then you just bring out wall. And guess what? Wall says if you have no cards on your turn, you can send it and activate network. Good cards. <laughs> Card is good. Good um, combo. Very slept on. Um, so yeah, it's power crap battle fader. I don't know why no one talks about that, but yeah. Uh, obviously we play network. We play two calling because we play seven numerons in the extra deck and two zexal. Um, so they're all the engines we play, the three main engines. They're pretty good. They uh, tie in well. So we're playing the one called by because Red Eyes Fusion is a card. Want it to resolve? <laughs> yep. Uh, we play two cards to search our field spells since we play six. Okay. For the set so rotation, do you give your opponent another meltdown or do you have... It just depends what I'm going for. Like okay. the, the ideal play is having Alistair and Zexal. Okay. So, sorry, set Alistair and Zexal on field. Sounds yeah. like a weird board, but well, that's that's the board I make. It makes sense, because Alistair triggers when flip face up. That's right. And flip Alistair is great because you make it, you link it away, make a mecha bar, and then you normal summon it and go effect. Yeah. And they're like, oh, you already summoned it. Yeah, it was a flip. <laughs> so it's kind of broken. Um, but here's where I was saying we have 16 starters because we have the three wall the three network the three alistair the three meltdown and then these two search it's almost like one card engines are good one card engines are great crazy <laughs> that um speaking of one cards reborn's a good card it can revive dragoon it can if you open alistair in this you can just go through the plays of like alistair link it away reborn it back uh, make a mecha bug going anaconda and then you've got the mecha bug to negate the hand trap yeah uh, hopefully uh, doesn't always work out, but you can hopefully get Dragoon Mecha to pass. Um, that's the only extender I play, so that comes up barely ever, but it's nice. Uh, and does in the seem, grind game, it wins. It does seem very broken if you do resolve it. <laughs> yeah, exactly right. Um, upstart, because I, I really just want to draw power and I can't play a single pot card. 40 card deck? 40 card deck, so yeah. 39, kind of. They're all the one odds. Two of these bad boys. I've jumped around three and two, because our locals is like Shadol, Eldritch a lot. And I hate that, so... <laughs> This card good against them, but um, two's just been feeling better because opening too many socks and you always open it against the decks you don't need it again. Yeah. Uh, this card wins games. It does win games. So the crazy thing here is all of our engines can still do what they want in two summons. Okay. So Red Eyes Fusion's obviously one summon. Yeah. Uh, Alistair searching in bro, and then making a mecha bark is two summons. The Numeron summoning is one summon. And then making Zaxxol <laughs> is your second. Is the second summon. So I can play under this pretty well. Other decks not so much. Very good. Uh, now we got the boring stuff, the hand traps, just three ash, three imperm. Uh, you could definitely cut imperm, but our locals has a kind of bit of anaconda. Yeah. Dragoon package going on, so I was like, fuck it. See, like, the bulk of our locals is like, cut these six cards, yep. and clearly they've come in well for you. Well, I mean, yeah. <laughs> They're, they're not the best hand traps, like, I just can't, I can't play Gamma, I refuse. Yeah. Another brick in this deck is just suicide. It's a bit so. too much. <laughs> so, um, yeah. Uh, let's get to the extra deck. There's nothing too crazy in here, very stock standard. We've got your invoke links. Uh, a lot of people like why don't you just play the, the uh, what's it called? Uh, 
The other light machine. No yeah, tigers. Uh, Gardner. Yeah, they yeah. say for when you play Gardner, uh, it's more just because you go normal and just into one of these. Um, I'll, so Al Mirage has his use in Yeah, I'll, I'll show you a little combo later which uses Al Mirage. Uh, it uses both of them. Um, it's real good. Uh, Anaconda because it's Anaconda. You, so I was questioning how many Anaconda you'd be playing. I literally play one. Okay. Uh, if it gets negated, great. <laughs> Hope your other <laughs> engines are doing something. Uh, invoked fusions. We only play two. Uh, another thing that surprises people. Um, we normally win by the time either of these come out. This is pretty it's, much just going to be game It's normally off. a scoop by the time something like this has happened. Yeah. There have been games where I'm like, man, I wish I had a third invoke, but it's very rare. So a lot of people just lose to Zexor or Dragoon. So it's funny. Uh, speaking of Dragoon, one, we play one. I used Ooh, to play one? two. Yeah, okay. I was playing two and like a bunch of stuff to get the second one. It's just more bricks though. Yeah. Uh, one's enough. Should be good. Here's where uh, all the good cards are anyway. So we play three gates for playing first and then the four gates for playing second. Uh, Mega Corpse is bad. Changed my mind. <laughs> I'd rather attack with gates and then make Zexal even playing second. So At first I was like, there's going to be tons of space in this extra deck, but it actually seems pretty tight. It, it seems real tight. Yeah, I've tried to change stuff and I can't really afford to change stuff. Yeah. Um, do you have time for a cute combo? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, it's really not a combo. But, uh, <laughs> We'll talk it's about <laughs> going second combo, by the way. We'll talk about your matchups as well once sure. we go through this combo. Uh, my cards are fucking everywhere, but let's just assume zoom I out <laughs> the manual way. Yeah, that's fine. So ideally, the opening board I said is Zexal and a set Alistar, and that's not really anything. But obviously, you attach from Zexal to activate it if it gets gammed. Yeah, we'll do. We're gonna assume it didn't. Uh, turn comes back to us. We flip the Alistar. Is the first thing you do. You go effect. If they don't ash it, uh, obviously you grab the Invo. I don't know where my Invo is. I'm gonna pretend this is Invo. Um, you link Alistar away for. Any, like either this or the, actually you normally want to go for the fire one. Yeah, you got tons of lights at this point. Yep, so you go for the fire. I should really do this the other way. No, it's fine, it's fine. Okay, so you go for Al Mirage. Um, and then you can, because you've got, you detached a light for your Zexal. Yep. You can now play your Invo, which is a meltdown wall. Uh, and you bring out Mech, which is somewhere. Cool, now you go Invo effect to add Ali back to hand and you yep. go back to deck. Summon Alistar, you go effect. You link these into Anaconda. You can now play your Invocation again and make Purgatrio since you just sent uh, El Mirage and Alistar. Yep. And then you can go effect of Anaconda to bring out Dragoon. Switch this to attack mode. Get your free pops, get your burn damage. Yeah, you go pop, pop, just... anything left, you go bang, bang. So if the Eldritch cards are being like held back, you're like, okay, this, cool. This, this, I don't care. <laughs> this kill. So you might think that's overkill, but because Eldritch is like pretty dominant here, it's just like, you may as well bring it out in case they bring shit out. Yeah. You can just swing, swing. Um, but yeah, this is like a crazy amount of damage. Awesome. That's pretty much how it goes. Take us through your matchups today. All right, round one was Andrew playing... Drytron? Drytron. Yep. Uh, I went first, so that turns out to be good because I go Zexus. Yeah. Uh, so that worked out. Um, next was... I put you on the spot. Yeah, sorry, I can't remember who. I could only remember you first and last. Who <laughs> I go second? Um, who lost to this man second? I oh, that's right. I versus Lachlan, uh, playing lost. Big Warrior Info Noble deck. Uh, I got first again. It was just die roll stuff. Did you really. win all die rolls? I think I won all die rolls today. Yeah, that tends to uh, good in the victory. Um, yeah, so game, or oh, round three, sorry, was against Jesse. Yep. Um, I lost the die roll, actually. Okay. I, I'm pretty sure. What was Jesse playing? Um, invoked Eldritch. Okay. So we had a bit of interactions with Invos and other people's Alistars and Yeah. Whatnot. But uh, in the end, I won game three, luckily. I had Ash for his ref, and he didn't have Ash for mine. So yeah. <laughs> simple as that. Um, then we went to round four with Duck. It was very, very close. Uh, down to the last couple of cards, actually. I was going to say, I do believe I heard you yell out that you had lost. <laughs> I thought he had it, uh, but summon limit is very good. Summon limit and very good card. There can only be one and summon, so I, I side there can only be one. Yeah. Um, together, they're r ridiculously good. Uh, and it, there can only be one only clashes with the Numerons. It's normally fine with every other engine, because Invoke just goes into random Yeah. Stuff. Um, but yeah, awesome. that, was, that was it. Cool, but thank you very much for the deck profile. Thanks Congratulations much. on the big win. Thanks, uh, See if you can follow up and win the house mat in a couple of weeks. Oh crap, yeah, you're right. Uh, yeah, you've got big pressure now. Yeah, so I'll try, I'll try. We'll see whether or not the ban list yeah. changed everything else. No ban dragoon, please. But as always, I've been Ben from Nolan TCG, here with Loza, and have a good afternoon, everybody. See ya.